Hi, I'm Nancy Kaufman, formerly of uh, Brookline, Massachusetts, and uh, Executive Director of the JCRC of Greater Boston for 20 years, now in New York, as CEO of the National Council of Jewish Women. And um, I am uh, a, a lifelong Bostonian. You can take the girl out of Boston, but you can't take Boston out of the girl. So I have kept my teams and my accent in New York. So the story I want to share is, a, is a really one of the formative stories of my life. When uh, in high school here at Brookline, um, I uh, was an active member of the B'nai B'rith Youth Organization. That was sort of my life uh, and taught me many, many, many things. Uh, but probably the thing that stands out most in my mind is when I first fell in love with Israel. Uh, I was a 16-year-old who desperately wanted to go to Israel, but my family did not have the means and no one in my family had ever been, but I decided as a junior in high school that I was going uh, and that I would apply for a leadership, uh, uh, the leadership trip to uh, Israel for the summer, the Summer Leadership Institute for B'nai B'rith Youth, and um, they gave out scholarships. It was $1,000 for eight weeks. Uh, you could get a $500 scholarship. So my first fundraising experience was asking my uncle if he would match the $500, which he did. The problem was it was 1967, and uh, I was supposed to go the summer of 1967. And on June 6, 1967, we will all remember that uh, a war broke out in Israel. And um, people were calling my mother saying, you're not going to let her go, you're not going to let her go. And I made a deal that if the State Department said it was okay for people to go to Israel after the war was over, that I was going. So a hundred uh, young teenagers from across the country were supposed to go in the summer of 1967. Fifty dropped out and fifty of us went. And it was probably one of the most uh, formative experiences of my life. Um, it's when I totally fell in love with Israel and have had a love affair with her ever since. Um, and I spent eight weeks learning, studying, um, participating in what then was really the most exciting, vibrant time in Israel. It was a time when here in the United States our cities were burning and the um, uh, civil rights movement was in full uh, array and I, I, it, it instilled in me a sense of justice that I have pursued ever since. Um, and it also, uh, B'nai B'rith Youth is where I met my husband and my very best friends. Um, I didn't go back to Israel for 24 years, but when I took the job at JCRC in 1990, uh, I started going again, and I've been uh, 40 times since. So uh, that's my story, uh, and um, uh, it's great to be here at Limwood, Boston.